of course, the Grand Tours, they are a great goal for us. We have a GC squad that is much stronger than before. And uh, of course, the Tour de France is one of the main uh, main goals of the season. We, we, are, we are really hoping that we can be there to fight for the victory. And, and that is a great step forward from what we did this year. Chris have the experience and I think he have a good team behind him to support him. The performance squad behind him to get him back on this level uh, is high in the team and I think we can reach it all together. We already saw in Dan Martin that he can be up there. Uh, he was in the in the Welta fighting the whole white Welta. And uh, with adding Chris Froome to the to the roster and Mike Woods and, and a lot of guys that are strong to support, I think it's a realistic thing to actually put that as a goal. The Israelis are part of the DNA of the team, there's no question about that. And, and so far we have every year seen how they have developed and they have stepped it up to the next level. And I expect them to do a little bit the same thing also next year. My idea is that they will, will still continue to develop and they will have a core, core uh, function in the team still. I think to, to put a highlight on, on it, we, we can name a few major goals that are either from individual riders or from, from the, the team. We have a strong, strong team for the Ardennes Classics. Races like Catalonia, Basque and, and, and Romandi will also be very interesting. Um, and who knows if we can do uh, all three Grand Tours with an objective of, of actually trying to, to achieve stage wins and, and, and potentially be there in the GC.